I think there are so many amazing recreational amenities that we're blessed with in our community. We all know that. I think a lot of people would say the Animus River Trail and Corridor is maybe the crown jewel of, of what we have uh, to enjoy uh, in terms of our outdoor recreational opportunities here. Every year, approximately 93% of our Durango residents use the Animus River Trail. That's been documented in survey work. Uh, we're blessed to have a lot of dedicated citizens and staff to help make these things come to reality. The Animus River Trail and the Animus River are two of the most popular recreation amenities in Durango and we are so fortunate and I'm just ha happy to be mayor of a town that respects and promotes uh, facilities like this for the recreation for all. It's, uh, it's what we need for mental health, it's what we need for physical health and it's uh, appropriate stewardship of the environment we live in. The development of the Animus River Trail extension and Oxbow Park River access is possible to due to the dedicated sales tax for parks and recreation projects. So I'd like to thank all those citizens, the advocacy groups that lobbied for the, the tax to be issued. The city invested approximately $6.1 million on the one-mile extension of the Animus River Trail and $2.2 million in the development of the Oxbow Park River access right here. Thanks to Great Outdoors Colorado, GOCO, the cost of this project was offset by a grant in the award amount of $1.382,955 for the trail. It's open and it's beautiful.